Hello my wonderful people, I hope you are all doing great. Welcome back to my channel, So with Agnes, I'm Agnes. So today we're going to cut and sew an asymmetric two-way neckline. So I folded the fabric, so an Ankara fabric. I folded it by using the bust measurement. The bust is 36. Quarter of it is nine plus one inch seam allowance and one inch for the dart. We put a normal dart. So I've already insert my lines, my vertical lines from the shoulder. This is the, the bust line. No, this is half of the armhole line. Then this is the bust line. This is the under bust, 14 and 16 is the half length. Then these two. Is for joining and other allowances and I've already marked this is three inches for my shoulder slant the shoulder measurement is half of the shoulder is the shoulder is 15 half of it is 7.5 plus half inch so it's eight and I've come down by one inch then I have this half for joining that is the, sh the shoulder slant then I brought the 8 inches down here again then I draw for the armhole I've already drawn my armhole curve so now I'm going to do the asymmetric two-way neckline so the neck that I will go in by is 4 inches 4 inches let me bring the it's 4 inches then the width is five. The neck width, sorry, is four inches. The neck depth is five. It's five inches. Then I will make a square. make a square then I will repeat the same thing to this other end this other end I'm going by four inches that is the neck width and the depth is five inches then I will connect to make my square Then I'll open it up like this. I'll open it up like this. I hope you can see the square. Then I'll go in by two inches on this on this go out by two inches on this end. That is just on just one end going by two inches. Then I'll connect. So this is now six inches from the center. It's six inches now on one side. The one, the other side will remain the four inches. Then I'll connect it to this the slant. Connect it to this. I'll connect it from here to slant onto the six six inches the six inches. I hope you can see it six inches. Then I'll cut I'll cut this. This is the front panel. And I'll cut this. And neckline. So 
So I've connected it. So this end is square. Then this is like a boat neck. So a two way neck line. So I'll cut it now. I'll cut the neck line. Then I'll, I'll do it like this again. Then I'll go to the back. I'll cut it like this. You have to take your time. Fold it, then I'll cut this the shoulder slant. I'll cut, I'll raise it up like this and cut it out. Do the horizontal measurements, but let me do the back for the asymmetric. Let me do the back. See, this is the front. See how beautiful it is. So, this is the back. This is the zipper area. So this is the back, this is the front panel, this is the back panel. I've aligned it and I've extended the lines. I've also put my shoulder slant and the arm bowl. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to cut the asymmetric. So we have to take our time because we know one side is six inches width. Then the one side is four inches. So what I'll do is I'll open it up. I'll, this is the I'll print this up the zipper area. I'll print the zipper area. To the right side, right side, this is the back panel, and this is the right side. So I will get the exact side, the six inches will stop. Exact side, the six inches will fall, and the four inches. So I'll open them up. This is the zipper area, and this is the midpoint of the the front panel. I hope you understand. <laughs> so I work on them up right side facing each other. This is right side of the back panel. The zipper area is in line with the center of the front panel. The front panel is right side facing the right side of the zipper area of the back panel. So So this is where the so I mark 
I'll come down the neck depth for the back is one inches. So this will be square, and then I'll connect it to the six inches. Okay. So this is the back. This is the back, this is the front. I'll come down by just one inch, then I'll cut it. My pin. So this is it, this is the front, this is the back. I've already cut it. See this side, I come in by one inch. This side is the square side, that is the four inch from the center, from the zip area. Then this is the six inches, that is the boot, boot neckline area. So this is how it looks. So I will go ahead now to cut out the arm wool for the back and I'll do all the other my horizontal measurement then I'll cut. I'll use the same, I'll use it to cut the lining then I'll sew it. So thank you my wonderful people for clicking and for watching through. This is our two-way asymmetric neckline that is the square and the boot neckline. Please like, please share and please subscribe to my channel. God will bless you as you do that. Stay blessed. See you in my next tutorial. Bye-bye.